Hello everybody, this is Magpie Cliff here and welcome to a new video. It has been so long since I last did a voiceover to a speed build because it's been a while since I have made a speed build. I've been so so deeply committed, I almost said, to making stop motions. I know I said, I think it was actually in my last speed build that I would never get into stop motions because it was just a lot of work and uh, here I am being uh, completely into it and uh, I haven't done anything else in a long time so I thought now it is time to get back into the speed builds and making voiceovers because I actually really enjoy talking to you guys and having a dialogue so here I am back in business making voiceovers for you <laughs> so hi <laughs> and to everyone new hi welcome i'm so happy you decided to join and check in to see what's going on here on this channel yeah i'm uh, I'm, I'm very i'm very happy that you're here so welcome if you're new so yeah let's uh, let's talk a bit about this build so uh, for a while now i have been uh, chatting with lois and on uh, twitter and uh, we've been hit hitting it off really well, I think. I really enjoyed talking to her. She's so, so lovely and um, I cannot recommend checking out her channel more. Uh, she's also a simmer who makes a lot of amazing, cool Sims content here on YouTube. She does uh, a lot of cool builds, she makes CC hauls and she plays uh, around with a lot of cool mods and she makes some really fun challenges. So definitely go check out her channel right after watching this and definitely remember checking out her video where she furnishes this build. So I'm sorry, it has been a minute since I last did a voiceover. Let me just <laughs> tell you all the information in the right order. Anyway, this is a collab <laughs> as you probably saw in the title of the video. Okay, anyway, so Lois and I were talking on Twitter and uh, she asked me if I wanted to do a collab with her, which was perfect because I w have been wanting to ask her for a while. So that was just uh, perfect, like I said. And uh, we decided to make a snowy spa. It was Lois' idea, so she will get all credit for that. And uh, I was uh, completely into it right away. So we decided that I would make the building itself and the exterior and then Lois will furnish it in a, a video on her channel. And I will of course link that below. So remember to go check that out right after watching this. And I am so excited to see what she did because I haven't seen it yet. And I know it's gonna be amazing. <laughs> yeah, I'm, uh, I'm very excited to see it. So uh, the build itself, it's um, very modern. And uh, I, I, I'd wanted to combine a modern look, like modern architecture, with uh, a, a still a warm and cozy look. So I put it in the outdoor retreat vacation world. I can't remember what it's called, but I, I think you'll figure it out. <laughs> anyway, uh, so yeah, I'm using um, warm wood tones with these very sharp edges. And I think it works really well. And uh, I tried to make it cozy looking. With, uh, with trees all around it. And uh, going in, starting to build this, I only had one plan, and that was to make this kind of sunken area that, that you can see in the bottom of the screen right now, uh, with these windows. And I actually first considered having that as the entrance to the spa, but I thought it would work better to be just like a, a viewpoint to the whole thing. Uh, so you can maybe maybe sit down there. I don't know because I'm not furnishing <laughs> so it's completely up to Lois actually <laughs> But I imagine that it could be an area where you could uh, Maybe sit or have a spa treatment and look into the forest um, But I guess you can do that all over this build because to be honest, I'm a bit of a window whore I put in way 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 too many windows in my builds and uh, and I, I told Lois that she could uh, make changes if, if she wanted to, so it's not like completely locked down and she can't move any windows or walls, because all the spa equipment have uh, specific uh, sizes and uh, like they need room around them. And I tried to make the rooms big enough to, to fit some spa equi equipment 
um, but I, I gave Lois the liberty to uh, to change some stuff if if she felt like it was uh, necessary and would fit in the uh, um, decoration and furnishing that uh, she was doing. Uh, yeah, let's see what else should I talk about. I, there's not that much to, to say about the build. Uh, like I said, I didn't have much of a plan other than the, the sunken look and uh, and I just kind of went for it from there. Uh, I wanted to not just make it a, a square box like I, I have a tendency to do sometimes. So uh, yeah, I tried to play around with uh, different uh, different shapes of the room. And uh, I wanted to uh, to make it tall, so I actually end up making a third floor uh, later in the video. So yeah, I think that is pretty much it. And uh, okay, maybe I can mention. Yeah, I um I played around with the uh, with the trees and kind of have some of them uh, going through uh, the roof, like this one in the front, right at the entrance. Uh, so it's maybe like. They built this building around the trees, so they didn't really um, take them down. So it's kind of um, uh, what's it called? I don't know. They they respect the nature around it and didn't want to destroy anything. And let's face it, nature needs our support right now. <laughs> Pray for Australia. That is some terrible, terrible stuff going on over there. Anyway, that's not what this video is about because that is just depressing, <laughs> even though it's, uh, of course, an important issue going on right now. Yeah. Uh, oh my god, it's uh, it's so weird doing voiceovers again. I haven't done it in over a month and I feel like I'm starting over every time I'm doing one and because I had this so long in between, so I, I kind of forget how to talk and what to talk about. And <laughs> before starting this uh, recording, I... Uh, <laughs> I was just sitting there, kind of, uh, I don't know, maybe practicing what to say, even though I can't remember anything when I start recording anyway. It's just, it's just stage fright. So at the end I was like, uh, Christina, just, just, just hit record and start talking <laughs> and it will be fine because it usually is. And please let me know in the comments if you can tell if there's a, a difference in the sound quality of this voiceover compared to my older videos because I got a new microphone and this is the first time I'm using it. I've been uh, been uh, testing in a bit to see what uh, settings fits with my voice and you know the distance to it like the distance between the microphone and my mouth and stuff so please let me know if you can tell and if it, you think it sounds better uh, quality wise like technically technic quality <laughs> uh, I hope I hope the content quality is is also better actually <laughs> please let me know <laughs> um, yeah I uh, so I'm kind of figuring out how it works best and I don't have a pop filter for it so uh, I hope there's no weird peaks in the sound like I just said a very loud P word um, I don't have pop sockets, so I I put uh, a, an old pair of pantyhose on it <laughs> to make kind of a filter to stop wind noises from my mouth. So it actually looks like a, a tiny little burglar <laughs> my microphone <laughs> because it has this uh, this old uh, old sock over it. Yeah, I think uh, <laughs> that's it for this video. <laughs> I'm sorry for rambling. It's uh, it's been a minute since I last did a voiceover, and um, I, I will I will keep practicing. It will get better, I promise. And don't worry uh, if you're here for the stop motions. There will be more. Uh, some uh, are on their way, so don't worry if you're here for those. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> I have to finish this uh, talk now. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this build and I hope to see you in my next video. Bye!